What's up, good people? Mark Holmes here, of course, with and Gig Economy. Michael is back. Back again. Only for about another week. Huh? Only for about another week. You're talking about your channel. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's back on YouTube. Yeah, three days a week. And three days a week. Thank God he's here because he is the master. I'm not lying to do this. He's the master of the uh, machine here because. Well, if I end up moving and, and you need to use the machine, you know how to use it. I'm going to have to have a talk with Gina and say, damn, Gina, I'm in trouble. I'm uh, working on <laughs> a special one right here, trying some different things. So, Michael just informed me. He was the finalist before. He was, well, he went for a second interview before the, um, the boss. The Giants. No, for the, um, for Houston. He went for no, a second I said before the, the, the whole thing with the Giants went. Yeah, before all that, he went, he, he was on a second interview as well. Like well, well, he's a finalist for the Houston Texans. Now, this is one of those things that I, I'm trying to look at this from different perspectives. And this is hard because I'm trying to paint a football here. It's carved out, but I'm trying to put the colors of the laces and everything else on here. Because I've got an eagle claw that's holding on to it, so I want it to look, look right. But Brian Flores, that's one of those ones where I wonder if the NFL went to the Texan and said, we need you take a bullet for the NFL because what better way could we say that oh this suit has no merit than if he got a job that's one way to kind of make the whole thing disappear I would think and second part of it is why it probably would make sense is if you want to keep Deshaun Watson because we know Brian Flores definitely wanted Deshaun Watson with the Miami Dolphins. So from that standpoint, it actually makes a lot of sense because the main reason that Deshaun Watson wanted to go was you had a New England guy, Dan O'Brien, I'm sorry, Bill O'Brien, who literally traded away all of the talent thinking that he was Bill Belichick and could wheel and deal and make everybody great. We found out there's only one Bill Belichick. And um, Sean Watson, when they hired the GM from New England, was like, man, I've been to this party before. and I don't want to be at this party anymore. Which do you think it is, Mike? Or is it both? It's interesting to say the least. Um, I bet you this is going to be another one as we're learning more and more things about how the way business is done in the NFL. This is where that magnifying glass will come in. I can't see shit. Um, now that we're finding out more and more about how the NFL does business with the whole tanking situation or wanting the teams to tank, you have to now question everything as is it above board or not? Mike, do you think Pro football is more pro wrestling? I mean, that's, that's what I mean. In the name of it, it's. I, I don't know. But I find it interesting that we hear that he is a finalist for that job the same day, or the, right after we find out there's a lawsuit against the NFL. So, what you gonna do? What you gonna do, brother? 
That is the real question. I'm rather proud of these things. This is, take a look at this. So, what we have to do here is once all this is dry, you sand all this, and this will make the lines real clear, crisp and clean. Um, you can see where we painted the eagle's head and this claws that are up in here and stuff and the football and then we're going to end up epoxying it so it's all filled in real nice we've done some really cool stuff like this is one boom from a picture it's not it's abstract art there i think it's actually pretty good he was wearing a plant shirt so you know i'm having fun with this stuff here and getting it together we're actually going to be trying to do something different today. Okay. Well, we're going to try and figure this out real quick, and I'll get back at you. Peace. So maybe the outlet's not working, and that's it's died. Um, let's try plugging it into something else. Because maybe that was the problem with you trying to kick on before. Did we hit the wires in that thing? Something wrong with the outlet? Is it coming back? Is it come back on right now? There's something wrong with the outlet. What the hell happened to the outlet? Because it's obviously the same thing as that right there. Um, let's see. You got your test drive handy? I one thing. Mr. Fancy. You're Mr. Fancy, but I would have just used a regular probe one. Um, yep, something's loose. Okay. What is that? Man? That's, um, ground's loose, isn't it? Uh, open neutral. Open neutral. Okay. Alright, so let's go back through and think. Huh? Yeah, I'm good at having the right tools. Okay. Oh. Yep, open 